the start streaming button, like, oh my god. Oh shit, I'm streaming my desktop, I forgot. Hold on a sec. Can I switch this shit, like, man? There we go. Oh my god. A match tonight, nobody fucking knows. Is my fucking mic working actually? I don't even remember. I haven't streamed in so long. Actually, it's free like, content, that's right. It is free fucking content. <laughs> I am gonna get the views, we're gonna fucking yoink the free content. What are your uh, deaths? Got that up on my, oh my monitor, God. got my Elden Ring, we're change good to go. The change the title stuff. So. Holy fuck. Just log in. No, it's last. I get them the alias. It's gonna be AIDS of the alias when I ask them. Haha. <laughs> they probably won't. They won't alias. But like. I'll At least they, they don't wear like matching cosmetics, so it's easy to kind of tell who's who. Should I put? I'm not sure. I'm not even gonna bother asking. I got bowl of onions, Kyle. That was farthest. It's funnier with the aliases actually. Free content for Chang. It is. It's a long way. Miss you. <laughs> I didn't get to watch Lay Scrims, but I do get to watch Lay Match. Also, not all on the server yet. Where's uh, G6 at? I have to like alt tab every time I get a message. Check my phone real quick. Haha. <laughs> <laughs> Bowl of onions. Hey, Sal, I can't, I can't tell you. I'm like 12. Kyle's on WG now? Yeah, he is. Cast content gang. <laughs> this is supposed to be free content. This is free content. We got the... We got the jump on RGL. They didn't know there was a match tonight. I didn't even know there was a match tonight until just now. Oh shit. Is WG High Five real or a meme? He's right here. Bowl of onions. Uh, it's real though. High five is replacing Alpha on the team. Look at that little chameleon he's got. What the fuck, it just disappears right away. We're a little behind as we're sitting in the SCB. It's kind of lame. Free 
fucking content. Jam if you want to get in on this. If not, then don't jam. Can we bash the flank scout. High five on Foggit. I don't think people can handle high fives Foggit. The C taps are too crazy. These pogos are too crazy. We got IHOF. We got L. Wall of Onions. Fartus. Flying Scout Drought is real. It might be. Oh no, I think that'll be good actually. You know what sucks about casting like this is that RGL is epic because they have the cheat feed, so they always have like that. They'll always be on like the craziest thing that'll happen. And when I'm like, I'm doing camera work, like all I can do is like, let's just watch this guy because it might be funny, it might be cool, and then nothing could happen. Like it's lame as fuck. That's like the one nice thing about the RGL cast, other than like the actual production. Well, yeah, I actually will miss air shots. It's like. Fun. Alpha got cut. Uh, I think some shit happened and high five is flying now. You yeah. know, don't, don't ask me. Do you have casting essentials? Dude, I have nothing but my game. And that's it. But that's all we need, because we're not here to actually watch the game, you know. We're here to, we're here to just chill and just watch these guys fuck each other up, I guess. I don't know. What happened to WG Alpha? Um, if you know, you know. Uh, what the hell? Give us the tea or the man of the people now. Um, I mean, I don't know, you know, like, some shit happened. And, uh, Kyle's on the team now. I can't tell you. If I don't know myself. Which I do know, but I'm not telling you guys. <laughs> He didn't vibe, he's flying scout, yeah, high five flying scout, ran some combo scout. I'll never do a 6 feet fetus, that's fast, Kyle didn't even get a clip in the Vitor frag video. Not a single clip, he is, he's actually super mad about that, so like, I don't know if you guys like wanna, I don't know, if you ever wanna bug him, just be like, hey Kyle, I didn't see you in the land frag video, I'm gonna piss him off. Oh, Jay's in here. Wait, is it Team Tower? Can I just do it? I don't know what to fucking say. These fucking fray nerds. Sci fi ringing? No, he's on the team. Oh, fuck. We gotta get this shit started. We got. How many we got? We got 11 in server? 10? Alpha cut, yeah, high five is the new player. What will happen to Alpha's WG jersey and never give him? I don't know. Did you give uh, Alpha's WG jersey? Uh, what? Someone in chat is asking about Alpha's jersey. He has mine. Still. Oh, he has yours. Yeah, he he, he wore mine at LAN. Damn, He's, dude. He just very forgot to ask Aren't for it like back. Aren't you like 6'5", dude? How big is that jersey? Uh, it's a actually, I was kind of loose on him, but he was sitting down most of the time. Mm -hmm. Yeah, pretty, pretty big boy. Add to the title, bro. Everyone's gonna say it. Whatever. There was a. Uh, I don't think it was. It wasn't anything like performance wise. It was just some other shit. But I don't know. Whatever. Everybody's gonna ask about it. Everybody's gonna see that shit eventually. Anyway. Can you ask witness for heavy tips? This guy wants heavy tips from you. Heavy you tip? Give me VIP, by the way. Uh, That's heavy true. tip of the day. Yes, never ever unrev. 
for any reason. Also, extra tip. Be friendly and get sandwiches. And that's about it. Don't give the STV to anybody. Yeah, this is my content. This is my content. I'm monopolizing this shit. I don't know how the Freyo nerds are in here. We have 62 viewers. That is like free money though. I didn't look, know. Dude. I, I didn't know Jay would leak. Oh, look, okay. dude. Yes, I you did. did. It's a no, Froyo group. No, you can't be giving that shit away. You can't I, give Jay I every thought... keys. Look, listen, guys. Like, this is like this is just fucked up. You know, we were trying to hop on the content for the first time in months, and now like our only monopoly has been given away to the Froyo people. This is the most fucked up shit I've ever heard in my life. From witness himself. That was just n not chill. Can you actually? Can you actually remove VIP? Huh? No, I was. Uh, sorry, I was asking. Can you actually? Can mods remove the VIP? Can you even give it VIP? Bro, you people. Uh, I don't think mods. I'm not even modding your chat, bro. No, I'm just, uh, I'm just like wondering. No, mods, mods can't get Oh, uh, okay. I didn't know that. I'll mod you. What's your Twitch? It's like witness something. Just one S and underscore. Fuck! Yeah, I'm gonna need the Froyo stream to shut down. This is the real stream here, by the way. RGLs and casting this in what universe? I got the jump on them skis. But Froyo got the jump on me, apparently. Which is fucked up, by the way. That's not cool. This is gonna be like a... We might have to have like a... Like, we're gonna have to talk to some lawyers about this, you know. I got the casting rights to this match. From both the teams. How did Froyo invade the SCV? We were betrayed by Witness, dude. I'm telling you, it's fucked up. Witness leaked it to Jay, and then Jay leaked it to the rest of the little scavengers. Which was not cool, by the way. This is the fucking longest pregame DM of all time. Okay. I know for a fact that the G6 people were like warming I'm a man up of the people, what? You're not a man of the people if you give anything to Froyo. That's like the opposite. That's I like thought, that's tyranny. I thought that's, I was giving it to my no, friend. That's dictatorship. That's what? Jay's an off, bro. He's an off. Jay is literally an off. Anyway. Anyway. This is just another Bandits chat, we're just... I'm just gonna have to switch the title to Bandits, we're banned again. What if we just pull up Habib stream and just... I just watch Habib stream, you know? Just like restream? Oh, no, this is fun. Now that Jay has... <laughs> Hunter will get it true! <laughs> RGO cast the worst matches but doesn't cast this. I don't think they even knew there was a match happening. Nobody on Froyo streaming? Habib is literally streaming its keys. I've already had enough. I've had enough of like this. Oh, we have we gotta ready up from IHOP. Shut him down. Shut shut Habib down. And Banny got it! What is this shit? Fuck it, real ones stay on this stream. Don't care. We got an epic mid, I'm gonna have to watch Laz. You know the people, I know the people want Laz first, instantly. 
Apparently the config's fucked up. Oh, running improved match timer. <laughs> Alright, we got a first kill right away. I think that's bomb would have just fed instantly. G6 is already leaving. And Logan's caught out here by last, but he gets two pipes. Logan managed to get out. They try to recontest. They lost both scouts now. Now that everyone should fall here. Howard's gonna get out to last. He's gonna meet uh, bot mode who fed instantly on the mid somehow. He didn't catch that, but it was a good chase. They've secured mid. Probably not gonna be able to take two off this. Laz was caught in with Logan. Logan actually 2 5 though. What about config? Alright, now it's even. Ransom's trying to peek here, poke around, see if they can get on two. They aren't gonna re? Nah. No, I don't think they're gonna re. I think they can just like end it, like when it gets to half. Um, here, you can probably walk Valley, maybe two men here on second, I think. Probably run like high five underpass and try to run deep valley here. High five's waiting here in the underpass spot. I don't know if he wants to go. I'm gonna get on last. I want to say we'll do the thing he's already in. Yeah, there's high five getting in through under. They managed to get Logan. That's a big pick. Now if high five lives. They do. They can recommit valley maybe. They're gotta help Ash on mid. I think they're gonna want to walk valley off this. Potentially try to get as deep as possible. Carter's watching house. Uh, I would probably have given that up and just went out. Yeah, he does give it up and watch it up. Go with him, actually. He's a good player. Oh, Fonz is scouting in the corner. He's getting arrowed. Bombwood's just dying over and over. But, Soapy gets the drop. Right there on Law Guy. And he gets another fucking direct on Brand Slam. When it comes to Salvage. It was taunting. The shot must have been, like, clean for him to be just sitting there taunting. Because he probably could have lived. Alright, so we have... It was scout behind, causing chaos, two behind here. Carter's 1 HP and the scout doesn't know. This is the luckiest shit I've ever seen, but he's definitely dead now, right? He has no idea what to do here. Oh, he's getting out. Wow. Imagine being in deep that long with a 1 HP. He's <laughs> to get out there. Now it's even again. Oh, that didn't go through, what the fuck. Alright, anyway, now well, we're back on even. What's up, Trev? Damn, I'm fucking bored, who's messaging me? Alright, Laz is bored too. He wants to just go die right now. I'm just gonna keep on Laz for a second. Another epic sack coming in. <laughs> nice sack. Wow, Howard's playing like so weird. It's such a weird spot in lobby there. I feel like it's such a sketchy area. Because it's easy for like multiple people to kind of get in that doorway if the soldier goes deep. They only solo sack this time. That's 7 minutes in the clock here. Metal is a good map, XD. I have a second about this. Yeah, I agree. Metal is like one of the worst maps in the pool and probably shouldn't have removed over clear cut, but whatever. Artist is walking in here deep. Took around some frantic space. Artist is not really getting any follow off this fight. Like, multiple people looking at Brent somewhere, but they managed to get two kills. Both scouts for a soldier and scout. This should be really good. Yeah, they got three now. So, G6 is gonna have to turtle on last year. We might have a. Lucas looks caught. Oh, Soapy kind of beefing those rockets there on the I 5. That could have been bad. Honestly, Winnis should have been really happy with just getting second here, but it looks like they're gonna try to pressure with the force here. Nice spawn from Laz. Howard commits out of spawn. Doesn't actually end up having to use. Good hold from him. Despite being in the corner, he actually goes forward, like towards the other team shooting him. I think if High Five didn't have to cap, then that would have been the force, but it was a good uh, attempt there from Laz, getting on. So, press tab, look at pings. Alright, so everybody in the server has 5 ping except for Soapy Meister, who uh, is struggling with 70. 
But you know, Marmalade would have two rocketed and high five there, so good cope skis. Laz going in for another sack. Landing right on Howard, really clean. No, and a drop. Yeah, that was really clean. I can't believe there was nobody who was ready to put themselves between Howard and Laz. Like it was a good attempt from Howard. Even he even got like the full hold off on the first rocket, and someone should have just been ready to shoot him there. But this should be uh, a clean push coming in with full ad here. I feel like the NG died too, so they know where the gun is. It's not really going to be moving anything. Actually, they'll have time. They're gonna have to move this gun, I think. Committing to it might be weird. Uh, he's gonna build it up. Bob was committed to this gun. They're gonna try the pyro stuff on the left or Maybe going main might not be too bad here, just to avoid the pyro. But. I don't know. This is gonna come down to uh, bot mode, really. Or this Cap's actually on pyro, yeah. Cap's actually managed to stay alive and stay healthy through the Uber. Oh, he does. Never mind. Alright, this should be a good push now, I think. Once you get through, like. Like, the whole thing about the Pyro is that the Pyro really needs to stay alive, or else you're just gifting a pick to the Uber, and then it's like, it's really hard to win this. So, once I get the Pyro pick, it's like a clean, it's a clean fight for the other team, basically. One kill on an Uber in the last is a good, it's like, a fightable, like, position. You just, you really only need that one kill, and then you can play. <laughs> a tier 3 demo map to grind. Just obsessed with jumping, it's fucking obnoxious almost. You need to stream some real content other than you just staring at your screen jumping for hours. Alright, let's just put this on Soapy. I feel like he'll do something entertaining. What's Soapy got for us? Bombs across, targeting the scout. Some spam. On to Maz. They're kind of ignoring him actually. He might be able to get a good bomb here, but he's just gonna off the spam. Trying to shoot the little ramp there so that Law Guy can't walk up or tag Artis. And he manages to go get Artis. Good pick from him. Ooh, if he landed on the roof, he stays alive there. I feel like you should take that risk and then you can maybe jump onto the panel. But now it's just not a fight of, like a fight they can take, losing two. So so far WG is looking solid. It's like a very like the first mid they got Bob, but instantly the mid was pretty much one after that. Second mid, a good waiting game for spam, and they actually managed to win out despite Soapy getting the pick that he was looking for. So Carter's going in here, trying to play aggressive. I think Laz might have been done, is that why? No, Laz just sacked, okay. That's good play. If I watch the Zilly cast and the Vanny cast simultaneous, I will both lose and gain brain cells. So which one is the cause and which one is the effect? I like that, yeah. I need to relax after shitting on Kev all night. Relax with the cozy drop map. Damn. Carter messed up like three jumps on live. Oh no, yeah. I don't even. All right, well we're back. We're just gonna have to put on Laz. He's the man of the hour here. Laz is probably walking up deep. He's probably gonna, they're gonna just do the same thing they've been doing. Single side. Oh, they're actually alternating. Oh, Carter needed help, that's why. They shove two in a house before the sack even comes off. This is not really worth it, I think. Okay, they get two soldier kills, which should still not really be worth it from Red. Yeah, they, so they just end up trading about all soldiers here. It's not really, um. Because it's like such a weird play when two people are going that deep, like behind, to get the kill. You shouldn't do it before the sack comes in, I think. Um, because the rest of your team isn't going to be able to help you, basically, for like G6. G6 wasn't able to follow up on their flank going that deep. Now they end up losing the ground because the other team is going to have better spawns and they're just able to bully them out, like, a lot easier. It just, it doesn't seem like a worth it play unless, like, the timing was just wrong. It's a, it's a good play to go for, the timing was just really wrong there. That was just so weird. Alright, so the sack comes in, two men in. They actually managed to get a pick. Losing three is gonna be bad here. I think Brandslam and Artist should try to stay on second. They should try to exchange Ubers here. Howard is actually really weak now. 
So this is gonna be even just this they should just call this off completely. Well the moment Howard is this week, like you're losing so much time, it's not gonna be easy to get on second here. There's a good like blind at or whatever the hell happened. And Bratsum finds a pick, so now now if they can work the gun here, then Laz is gonna have an opportunity to sack and force uh Howard potentially. Let's see what happens. So he gets through. Trying to spot the gun, he's spamming it, they're double spamming the gun, eat a lot of damage for it. Bobbit actually just switches off completely and goes heavy. And now, they've lost both soldiers. They've lost three again, but this time, they don't have any picks, and Howard isn't weak. But they're gonna opt to stay in. So this is gonna be, this is gonna be all on Brand Slam, honestly. Let's see how, uh, well he takes this exchange. So Reducer should just die here, this is a free pick instantly through the Uber. Howard doesn't use though, this is good. Brand Slam also is got COVID, I think, so he's, he's like, not 100% here. Well, small cope. Why am I talking like it's a demo? I don't know, man. What do you want from me? I don't know how to fucking cast, okay? <laughs> Ransom does have Ligma. They lose one. They actually managed to get the Uber out. No, Kyle pushes behind, manages to trade out bot mode. This is a good pick. Now, the rest of the just can recommit while they're looking back for high five. There's, there's enough space for them. Carter needs ammo, it looks like. They're actually just leaving. Now, I guess they didn't want to take the fight 4v5, but I think that's like a good fight to take when you have that much space. Like, you're already in that deep. They all have to like play the point, so it's weird to just back off there. But they have pretty decent ad. I guess they opted to just play the ad there. Muster is up 3-1 against Cozy right now. That's an upset. This. The caps is caught, alright. They're just gonna, I think they're just gonna reset here, even Ubers, just chill. I think you're kinda talking like a medic TVH. What does that mean, dude? No, he's not. If there is, no, no one is streaming it, no one got a CV, okay, well, whatever. We have this match, so, better match, right? In theory. Oh, Carter beefs on Howard there. Nice hold, though. I don't think, uh, even if we got that rocket off, Howard would have held that. So they managed to push them out. All guys actually not too far away from Uber. Let's see what Logan and Caps do here. If Logan offs the bomb in, maybe they can catch him. Using here would be a mistake with two soldiers down, though. Now that they've cleared the trap, they should be able to just walk in here. Ball guy actually managing to get Ubered last second here, but the fight, but they have enough room. Okay, they're calling it off. I think, yeah. They the fight would have been, I think, like interesting there because even though the other team got Ubered, they didn't actually have good positioning there. They actually fell off height, so it was like kind of like an even fight. The only difference is that WG owns the point, so if they ever end up trading players, the Swans will be in favor of WG. But they actually don't commit, like they don't follow through on the fight, which is fine. That's a good choice. There's no reason to take a risky fight there. So they get the single last sack, and they're actually catching Kyle. Nice rocket from Rakusa there. Now if they can get on the other team's combo quick enough, put like good damage on them, then they should be good. Artist doesn't actually have any traps to hold the doorways here. And they have the picks this time. This time, WG actually does have good positioning, so they actually managed to find a kill here. Well, I take some damage. Cap's trying to get aggressive off that, but he gets really hard punish. I don't think he realized it was an artist who was weak though. It was Wall Guy who caught the damage there. And they've lost both scouts. I don't know if this is gonna be doable. Maybe a double soldier sack from WG would be really good here, honestly. Kyle taking the beam here. This is a good thing about the Kyle pickup, is um Kyle's like pretty much only ever played combo scout. So he's gonna he's, he's like gonna be flexible enough, you know, it's a more comfortable role for him to actually take control of the beam, walk you one. And you can see that here, how like they're finding kills. Like he kind of beefed on Ruti so a little, but I guess he just didn't have pistol loaded. But RNG. So now they've actually milked up the Uber pretty well. They're not getting the force out, actually. This is really good from Wall Guy and the scouts of uh, WG. They know the scouts behind. They just have to ball up on point now. Kyle's doing a good job of keeping the scout in check. Caesar's two behind. This is not um, actually the best for G6 because now they're split off and the other team has full Uber, so they could choose to just ignore these players and go straight to last while these guys are cut off. Ash actually dying to the two behind, but they're opting to go forward here, so Branson wants to take the Uber in the last. This is good for him, I think. Yeah, full add. They, they, they're a little delayed uh, use, but 
You manage to get the get the kills here and free. Just all the kills are having to come to point to stop the calf going off. An artist and Lazar is gonna feast here. Nice pipes, you know. Boom. 2-0, clean. That was really well played. G6 played that like kinda uncomfortably. I didn't see uh like it was a like, one for one, it was a really good milk. I didn't see what force Howard, but it was a really good milk from um WG. Both scouts played that like very well, just get good positioning and I think uh, G6 couldn't like co fully commit on getting the force or else they would just wipe and then WG win the round anyway but it ends up being worse when two people are just stuck behind. So here we are again on mid. Bakuso just trying to take space early. He takes too much damage though. He's gonna have to get the catch up bow here. They actually have a lot of ground though here for G6. Nice rockets from Bakuso. It's one direct. So all of WG is super hurt here, and Caps is going to be able to find Carter Frag. Laz is already getting out, so WG is going to off to leave um, mid completely. Now, G6 is going to try to pressure here, try to walk in deep, you know, get a soldier in. I, I've said that like a lot already this game, but that is basically this map and most of the sixes. So here I'm, I'm just keeping on a Topi because I'm expecting him to be the one to do something, but he's actually rotating house. Maybe a sack through house might be good for him here. No, they're already they're spawning it really deep. Now I don't actually know what G6 is doing here since Soapy rotated, and Rakusa should have been the one to go. But now they're just gonna have to reset completely. But that was like a good opportunity um, off the chase, basically, because you actually have room to go there. It doesn't really make any sense to just kind of pause and not do anything once they've given you that space to walk in early. Now, now Artist is like set up, right? That's the issue. You've given Artist time to get ammo, get health. And for uh, their spawns to come in for them to reset. But G6 is gonna s try to slow it down. I'm expecting a two man maybe. Um, really depends on what Bombwood wants to do. I feel like, you know, Bombwood's kind of the guy to watch for. The guy you like shut down if you want to play against G6. He's like really important cog of like how they play because he's so. Uh, he's always playing aggressive and always kind of like the one to call out targets or like call sh stuff out for the rest of the team. So. I was expecting bomb mode to kind of... Okay, he's chilling. They're just single sacking. It looks like. Yeah. Soapy dies. Now bomb mode might go because they, they got... Since they got that pick, bomb mode might have won and went. But it looks like Caps end up dying, so now bomb mode has to live. He has to shepherd Howard out. The combo of uh, WG is pressuring alone. Trying to trade off kills here. That was not worth it for anybody to really stay in. Everybody should be already be leaving instantly. I don't know why they overcommitted their stay. Now they just have Uber to sad. It was weird. I, I probably should have been watching someone else. I expected Bobman to actually go ahead and do something there. Looks like there's no way Artist would ever miss the pipes. Artist was goaded. That was a while ago, I guess, on the last. We have full Uber out here. So I want to see what Branson wants to do with his Uber. Kyle had a nice flank through house. Okay, well, that makes sense. G6 would have reset without it, plus he lived. Yeah, I think the problem was um, the guy Valley, like, actually managing to trade out the players. That was like the... Okay, well, this is bad. There's no way. There's no way this should be good. Logan's really weak, though. Both scouts and the med rotating already, so let's see what, uh... If they can get this fast push off here. Looks like they might want to bomb. Logan's been weak for a while, though, so he's gonna get need to get healed before he can jump in. Soapy goes down. They match a trade out. Um, Carter from they know Laz is behind, so what's the play here? It looks like no one was back to deal with him, so Caps is bringing the whole combo back to try to fight fight him here. It's actually two people. Laz is missing though. Where did Laz go during this fight? All right, Laz actually managed to get out in the front. Four v four now, but they lose it. They lose another scout here, so now the push is going to be called off. But there's a sizable ad. So, but no scouts though, actually alive. And Rakuso feeding there is not ideal, actually. Now that's... I was gonna say that with both scouts down, you have plenty of time to reset if you were G6, but Rakuso dying there, now it's just bad, because they can just walk in without waiting for their scouts, which they're already doing. Boom, Soapy goes down. Sort of the weekly Zilly streamer main. Dude, there's no content for me. It's just impossible to take a little bit of a line. Yeah. It depends. Uh, it, it honestly depends, Keys. Like, it's impossible to do it, like, six up, like, two teams full health. Like, six, six v six. But, if there's, like, you know, 
good bowling, good openings, then you know it's always something is always possible. If the other team fucks up enough, you know, but when both teams are like good and healthy, then it's like impossible for sure. You know, you literally need perfect spread pressure. Yeah, you need an opening like for somebody to like draw enough eyes or like your demo to do like crazy random damage. So actually, uh, speaking of which, Logan manages to kill a wall guy somehow. I think he dropped. So now uh, WG should just be retreating completely. Nobody should really be going for them. Yeah, they aren't. Okay. So if you're G6, you have Uber here. So they're actually going Valley. Caps off the stickies early. He's taking his time clearing them. You know, Artist gives up the trap. Plenty of room to walk up here. Logan wants to bomb, so they bomb in, use in, they actually catch Artist, but they lose bomb mode, and they catch Law Guy though. This is completely worth it now. But, oh, Soapy, he didn't know the soldier was on him. He actually manages to jump into like the perfect spot and kill Laz that way. That's so funny. And great, what a great wipe here from uh, the side of G6, despite dropping bomb mode early. Law Guy and Artist were just overcommitted and got caught, and the rest of the team kind of had to die trying to salvage. And Sophie manages to win his 1v1 to stop the only thing that might have been like a threat, which is Laz being behind. That was good. You know, that was good, uh. Good time for him. Alright. This is. They're actually making up this app. Law Guy's so good at building. Law Guy is so good at building. Like I don't he's always so close to Uber. So once Logan Uber's in here, Law Guy, if he's not caught, should be able to just repop back in like pretty on a pretty good tempo. They're gonna lose both soldiers though, so I don't know if they'll want to. I think Branson does want to though. Look at the way he's playing. Law Guy might be calling it off. No, he does want to. He sees them all close, but nobody's here to help him. They actually do manage to get the point. Nice jump. Oh my god, that was amazing from Artist. That was actually incredible. He jumped like from back here, landed on the point to stop the cap, and then caught the scout in the corner. But G6 just pushes back in and matches the cap instantly. I thought I didn't think Artis was there in time because uh, he wasn't there to help Branson with the guy he was fighting in lobby. But then he just managed to get in and catch the scout. But then they still lose anyway, though. Just like surprising. And you guys are haters. Already does look boring. Bomb's getting rolled this game. Yeah, he's been feeding pretty hard. But this is a chance for redemption. They're gonna try to take this, but they don't. I don't think they realize that Law Guy is just so good at building that he already has Uber. Law Guy, Law, you will never catch Law Guy on that light Uber ad. It's just they're just WG is a team that will always like try to play like that kind of option as safely as possible. Just, you know, textbook. Wow, look at the cap time though. This has gotta be a bomb mode. And he manages to trade out Artist! But Howard's already out. And they're gonna be able to take second off that. There's a great trade on Artist though. That actually gives you refight potential here for uh, Red. So Red doesn't have to worry about um, blocking the cap. They just have to worry about retaking since Artist is dead and they should take this fight. So is already in. Caps is rolling out. Logan's already on the point. Gets Manages to find Carter. Nice rockets there from Sophie. The other scout actually managed to get out, but they've. Oh, you should just lock, just lock, just chill and lock, guys. No need to get too excited here. All guy does have Uber ad though. They realize it. This is a 30 ad here. Trying to go out shutter it, but they don't know where the other team is. Oh, they they ooze so early and they're trying to wrap the last. It's actually a disaster, I think, here for G6. That Uber was popped so early through Shudder, they didn't know where the team was. They had no idea that the Uber was coming in from behind them, and they just lose everybody for it. And Ransom's just collecting here. Manages to live. Law Guy manages to survive any salvage attempts. Doesn't look like any back caps going on, so if he's trying to get out, nice jumps from him. Great movement here. Option to get out. Bombwood's on Spy, so we have to watch him. I don't know if uh, we'll be expecting this. This is a good. Seems like a good timing to me. It doesn't look like anyone's really wary of it. Alright, decent decloak. No, he, Law Guy was turning around. He didn't hear it though. Good spy play from Bob Mode. Manages to get Artist as well. Puts a lot of damage on Kyle. Great play. Great value for that. He, didn't, he managed to tag Kyle once, I think. Um, but now. G6 is in position here to take two. 
So let's see how the salvager time comes in. I wanna see if Carter or Laz are up to anything. They're also trying to spam the choke still. Looks like they're just gonna give it up. They don't wanna die here, they're just gonna wanna go to last. No salvage time coming in. We don't have any off classes here from WG. This is a problem. No gun, and the other team is about to get Uber. But Branson manages to get Logan. He manages to pun punish Logan hard there. Although, it might not matter because they're able to walk in. They, ha they still use here. They have most of WG in spawn. Caps finds a kill during the Uber. But the collapse! Artist and Ash just nuked the entire team. How did they manage that? Everybody was just stuck inside each other, I guess. Artist doesn't get traded out this time. Bombwood can't keep finding that kill. And uh, Logan's retreating here, so we, we might have a... No, all the spawns come in, wow. Howard is hungry for that Carter kill. Big ad here on the side of... Uh, big ad here on the side of our uh, WG here, guys. There's also a LAN rematch. These two teams haven't played uh, a match since LAN, huh? Tomorrow G6 can win this round. Da -da -da -da. Howard lived. Lots of Howard's so good. I feel like everybody in the server is so good, you know? Like, I don't know. Oh! Nice rocket from Rakusa to find last! <laughs> Uh, unfortunate timing? I'm not even really sure what that was. <laughs> I don't really know where Laz is going there. He wasn't fully healthy. Alright, well, Carter's gonna die. G6 finds three fix here without a... Uh, okay, one one respawn, but they found three fix here without using. Caps is capping. Oh, he should just be going. Helping Wild with Cap, uh, you know, I don't really like it. There's room here. Uh, Laz is trying to flank behind. Tags bomb with a rocket. Bomb just chooses to ignore him. Kyle's behind with him. We have two people stuck behind. Although G6 popped through Uber, didn't find anything. And WG has Uber now. They'll be able to block the point. With two people behind, this is going to be bad for G6. They've managed to find Kyle and Laz, but the Uber comes in. Caps is trying to run his medical away. They managed to trade out for 4v4 here. This might be okay. Howard ends up dying to Brand Slam. Artist finds Logan. But Bombard with the salvage. Right on the. Right on our guy. On Law Guy. Chaos all around. Looks like uh, mid is gonna go in the favor of WG though. That was really sketchy. Two people get behind, you have this ad, and then Uber comes in. You know, like. It was a good salvage to find Law Guy in the middle of all the chaos, but. You know, you gotta wonder how that happened. How did two people manage to get behind that cleanly? Really ballsy play from the UG. WG is gonna uh, re-enter this with their spawns. G6 is trying to, was trying to get in before they were fully set up, and they looks like they got punished for it. They weren't able to find any kills. Oh, well, they found Laz now, but they're still not, like, completely healthy. They actually healed up pretty well. They actually have gained lots of ground. WG looks like they're the ones who are being bullied out. They find Carter now. Now you can, you can get the cap off at the same time. Keep, you know, they're just trying to keep it rolling here. Even Ubers though. Laz is gonna get a spawn. I don't. It doesn't look like Logan is playing like he knows that Laz just got the forward spawn. Laz is hiding in the forward spawn here, coming out with the timing. Right on a Howard. Manages to get him. You know, shoot the two rockets at two of them. All you need. Brand time's gonna find a kill here. That was such poor. Um, like. From Caps and Logan, that was so poor that it doesn't register in their mind. They're not holding tab and immediately seeing that Laz got spawned. You should, you should know right away that he's gonna be in there. That is that isn't on Howard really. Um, like they should know that Laz is in the forward spawning. Yet you, you can't like lose track of that. You just can't if you're the combo. Like someone should be saying like anybody on the team should be in, Laz got spawned. Laz got spawned, and then you should know that right then and there you gotta. Lock, either lock the spawn door down or take a different route to get in. That's why I'm trying to pressure here. They have slide out there. They don't have Uber. They're not even waiting for Uber. We already have Soldier in high. Ransom finds Soapy. Makuso is going to be able to get the Soldier, but it doesn't really matter. For some reason, bomb mode is <laughs> dying on NG on the point. They call a config. I don't know what happened. 
Oh, I think the time. Oh, that's why they dried. The time was around and they have to change the config. So it's 2 0 only. It's 2 0 only. That should have been 3 0 right there, but the time ran out. And then the Banny config kicked in, so they had to manually end it. Literally, any of the six have to be aware that last ports. I know. Everybody has to be holding tab there. We got a good game going on here, though. G6 is struggling to convert. They're struggling, to, like, to keep basically their core uh, combo alive when trying to get in the second. So they really haven't had many chances to sniff in the last. They had the one chance, but then artist or Logan ended up dying because Branson punished them, etc. You know, like it's just um, I don't know. It feels like they're getting antsy. They're like trying to move when there really isn't anything to move off of. And when they're walking forward, there doesn't seem to be like any objective in mind. Whereas on the other hand, um, right now WG is playing very solid. They're they're basically getting what they want out of their playstyle. Um, G6 Loki overheating every team fight they win. Yeah, I agree. They're winning. They're doing well in team fights, but when they're like trying to like um, like transition in the second and in the last, like they're struggling with, with like the flank kind of coming in and. You know, they're they're overestimating Uber ads, etc. Right now it's 2-0 for WG. 2-0. Yeah, you kind of need to reset every fight against WG. I agree. That's a good call. But um, the real issue is just like if they, the problem is is that they're not realizing how long it takes, like say, get from mid to like this alley area to uber in and then to catch the med so they're like losing those slight ads and they're overestimating them law guys like getting uber when he needs to they're they're really undervaluing like how hard law guy will build uber basically I've, i called it like a couple times that they just really don't understand like um or not understand but they they just don't know that law guy is getting uber essentially and then they're trying to like commit an uber push thinking they have slim ad to go for the med when it really should be use that slim ad to walk in and then like get as many people through whatever doors that WG has given up to build Uber. You know, that's like that should be their objective is to just look for kills, not for law guy, basically. Look for look for Laz, look for Ash, look for look for an overextending scout. But um I do I do really like the high five pickup. I feel like it gives uh, WG a little bit more of like a flexible kind of bounce flying scout. You know, Yite was more of a go all in for a playmaking kind of role, you know. Just absolutely dominant flank, whereas High Five is gonna, you know, settle down during the team fights and just link up with his beam and then try to like find free kills and stuff. But so far, um, it's a pretty good match. I think. If G6 like wants to win this, um, I think for one they're gonna need to play a little bit uh, less aggressive. Like their team fights are fine, but they need to really like identify what their goal is when trying to take an area. It's it's very like confusing watching like the way Caps is playing. Like I understand he wants to do something, but I don't understand what. He, what it is he really wants to do, you know, like, it, it just doesn't make sense too much of the time. But, uh, we got a good match so far. We have a time limit change, we have a config. Yeah, we're in a half now. So far, a good game, though. I don't know. Um, I need to pull up logs. So let's close wait, some of these. I need to pull up logs. TF. Hold on a sec. I'll switch my display. So we're looking for. Grand Slam. As always, I'm scared to stream desktop, but...
Right, let me know if you guys can see this. Actually, I'll be able to see it myself in a second. Uh, so we got Brand Slam absolutely dominating. COVID is not affecting him. Artist is playing very well. Logan's doing okay. I feel like he's been dying at like inopportune times. He's got four more deaths than Artist, which is a lot if you consider like how close the team fights are. Bobo is absolutely struggling right now. Um, which is uh, you know, that's a part of the the game plan if you want to play against. Uh, I just gotta check real quick because they're going live. But um, that's part of the game plan against G6. You know, their bi their biggest, their greatest strength and biggest weakness. It's just that ball mode is always going to be the most aggressive player on the team. He's always going to be looking for that opening. You know, his his entire like the entire thing about ball mode is like he'll kill everybody who uh, isn't looking at him. Essentially, you know, that's just. Just how he is, how he like what he's good at. Uh, on the other side, we have the WG soldiers. Not the prettiest stat line, but you know they're getting, they're finding, they're finding like good med picks, etc. Good forces. We got, we have even med uh, deaths, but it feels like, it feels like Law Guy has done a better job at milking Ubers when like the exchanges are happening. Howard's playing pretty well too, though. He had that great surf earlier. And uh, it looks like Rakus is doing well statistically. Yeah, I don't know. But uh, I'm just gonna pop off that and go back to TF2 because fuck that. And that's that's it for the stats. I I'm not a I'm not really a numbers guy. But the stats do like show what we've been seeing. It's kind of reflective. Is that the the WG combo has been playing better. Then, uh, the WG combo has for sure been playing better than the G6 one. You know, it looks like, you know, they, they know what they want to do, and they've been playing their game plan. They let their soldiers do the work for them, and then they just uh, secure whatever it is that's left. Did Alpha get cut? Alpha got replaced by High Five. That is, uh, yes, that is what happened. Alpha has been replaced by High Five. But, uh, you know, I've liked what I've seen from Kyle. He's had a couple plays where he's been able to run behind and cause some chaos. And it's, you know, he's been able to trade out uh, kills that look unfavorable for him. I know he doesn't he doesn't actually enjoy the flying scale roll, but it seems like he's adapting to it pretty well. So, halftime adjustment for G6 in my mind is. Um, Bobo needs to pick his spots better, for one. You know, sync up with Soapy more. I haven't seen the two of them actually really work together at all. And. <laughs> and, uh. For, uh, the other part is like. Caps really, Caps and Logan kind of need to just figure out what they're doing. Getting Howard dying there on second to the last coming out of forwards was just so... It's just so bad because, one, you know Laz is spawning. You see him come up. If you don't spot him, then you know he's in the forwards and that's that. You know, it's just all this stuff. I mean... WG getting impatient here. They want to close this match out. Modern Flying Set is basically calling this guy. To me, just switch out WG play. <laughs> oh my god. Alright, well we're going live here, second half. Alright. I need a... If anybody's still in this chat watching the stream, give me a quick vote on who we want to watch at mid. Like, I don't know. I'm thinking we just put on the fan favorite Laz, because I'm lazy, but... If anyone else wants to watch anything, I'm for it. Nobody's going f too fast. Oh, Sophie goes fast. Doesn't actually manage... He catches rockets for that. So he's the one who comes out of that exchange worse off. I was gonna grab the pack for some small health bonus. Just looking for spam. 
Looks like they're... Okay, he does a little mini hop. Logan actually gets punished here, so... WG uh, is going to be on the chase here. I'm going to watch Carter see if he can catch anything. Doesn't actually try to land on the player leaving. He would have fed if he did. Good call on his part. So now we have uh, a demo kill here. They're going to try to take ground while the demo's still dead. Looks like they're just waiting for everybody to group up here. Grand Simon and Kyle capping together. Artists trying to walk Valley early. Everybody wants to watch Laz. I'm just going to put it back on him because... He, he had a pretty chill mid. He manages to get deep in, but this time, uh, Soapy's in the way, body blocking for Howard. And uh, High Five actually had an opportunity there, got two shots off, but if Laz had tagged some damage, then maybe Howard would have had to use or force or dropped even. But thankfully, uh, Soapy body blocked all that earlier for him. So, what do we have here? Soapy's, you know, they're trying to get in the mid. Stuck your si Oh, Soapy manages to... No, he's getting out, he's getting out. Alright. Yeah, they realized they couldn't do anything. Soapy's been weak for a while, though. Manages to get arrowed. Yeah, metal mid is so rough to get in. Like, it's so hard to get in cleanly. It's just such an awkward map. Like, the doors are so easy to just put spam on. Nice spawn from last to tag two soul players of damage, but... Not, looks like Brandsheim wasn't able to find anything off the damage he did. Um, High Five was stuck there watching the war, but they actually managed to take down Rakuso there. I think he got air shot. Carter kind of absolutely uh, directed him. Or something happened there, I don't know. I can't tell you. But Carter did a good job of just defending the house area and then finding the Rakuso kill when Rakuso tried to flank. He's gonna die. But they managed to find a trade here, so and there's plenty of damage on the side of uh, for, for WG to work off of. Looks like they call it off though. Laz is wanting to get buffed before he goes to sack, giving up the house area here. So we're gonna go for it anyway. I want to see what uh, so Laz should go die here. I want to see if they clean up the skill cleanly. Rakuso can has an offer to use something. He trades up for Logan. What was Rakuso going for? He manages to find the forces. What Rakuso was going for? Now Caps has Uber. WG can't overcommit here, not that they want to. Artis is actually getting card punished. He walked in a little too deep to try to pressure, but he manages to get out barely. 20 HP, gets arrowed. But they still have Uber to work with. But th with, if they had gone that Artis kill, this would have been so clean. Nobody was there to help Caps. Both soldiers here trying to stuff the door. They decide to use through, find a single soldier kill. Caps is putting on a lot of damage, but they're overcommitted. Howard might die for this. He manages to get out clean. They don't overcommit. They actually managed to get Artist Soapy trading for him. It's a good play. Now, now we have a recapture here. Or we have mid going off to the side of G6. Add in the favor of Wall Guy. Alright, well my camera work isn't too great, but we're just gonna have to watch the Uber, so Brandslam's coming in, finds absolutely nothing, just gonna reset here, they know there's nothing here, Artist is gonna set up here, add in the favor of uh, G6, we're starting the leapfrog here, basically no kills going off on, this, on one side. So I'm gonna switch over to, uh, let's see, yeah, Cassius is Uber here, I kinda wanna watch Logan, see what he targets here. I think so far they prefer the bomb in, rotating towards the house area before they jump. He's gonna go main, might not have enough ammo, and his u <laughs> And Artis just completely shuts him down. Howard actually didn't uber there. Um, Logan wanted to jump in, destroyed himself with the jump, but got s and then took damage, a pipe and a sticky from Artis, and died. Absolutely tragic. Howard manages to hold Uber, so they have a fighting chance here on second, despite just, you know, deciding not to try to go in a mid. A little, oh, and they get the Uber off here. Ex exchange is going off here in the favor of Wall Guy, but it's actually pretty equal since Wall Guy ended up flashing. And we just might have a 6v6 dry fight here, maybe, if we're feeling ballsy enough from the side of uh, WG. No, they're not going to. Oh, maybe they are, they are, they're feeling ballsy enough. So we have Brandsheim going deep, Carter trying to land on whoever he draws forward, or Brandsheim draws forward. Doesn't look like anyone in G6 overcommitted. Caps eating a lot of damage, his soldier's getting in behind, and he caught the arrow through the shutter! 
and ends up killing Howard for it. Incredible, incredible play there. I think that was uh, Ash who got in, but Walleye gets collapsed on. That was crazy. Like right here, the arrow flies through the shutter, hits the soldier as he kills Howard. And now we get, but the fight still goes off in the favor of V6, so another team fight won from them, but again, WG is just finding, like, just enough players, like the right players to kill so that they don't get steamrolled. Right now, like, um, I don't want to say that was Howard's fault, like, Howard is probably screaming up that, like, and then the soldier gets arrowed, you can't really do anything about that, but when that happens, it's just hard to continue momentum, but, um, Honestly, I don't really know what's been happening with Logan. I feel like Logan's been dead, like, a lot at these moments where they really need him to continue a push, I guess. So slight add, though, in the favor of Howard. Are they gonna take another slight add, or, or will they just respect... Okay, well, now they have to call it off. Bomb already tried to a trap, so... So, oh, okay, they just trade Laz for Bomb Mode. Um, oh, Logan ended up dying. Artist finds two just for himself somehow on, in the underpass area. And crazy. And Kyle with the clean flank right on the Howard gets the force out. He's going to die for this, but, you know, he, his job is done. He's completely happy with this. But it looks like whoever this is, Caps is beefing completely. Missed so many shots on him. So they're going to have to wait here for the spawns. And then, oh, uh, they're often going to take it house because they actually did kill Logan. A second ago. Brand Slam dying though. Uber's gonna just. They're gonna have to take Kyle here, so we're gonna get a classic balls Uber in a second. Where's our guy? Our hero, our protagonist. This is his Uber. Second play Kyle makes fun. Yeah, but the problem was is that they dropped so many people before that, right? Like. Honestly, like. You have to wonder, like, if you lose three people like that, the flying sail getting in clean isn't really, like, a, like a wonder, you know? And they're gonna actually be able to milk walking in here. They don't use... So, it's gonna be even Ubers. Logan and I are doing some damage, but I don't think they're gonna want to take uh, the fight. We're just gonna have to sit on mid here. Just let it even out. Copium? Yeah, some Vaughn definitely hitting their shots right now either, yeah. Forces are cooler than kills. I'm gonna. <laughs> All right, even Ubers. We know WG's game plan. Walk a little bit in the alley. Branson runs forward to draw people into him. Last hacks. That's what they like to do. But they're taking both soldiers this time. Carter's gonna go first and fade off. I think he feels off. Last targets a demo man. Gets one, ro two rockets onto him. Logan managed to survive. 260 is a lot of. Nobody else hit him. So 260 HP. Hard to get that kill, but Soapy finds the force with the counter sack. So now Caps and Bombo are already bullying through. Just no traps, nothing in the way to force them. And they're gonna keep trying to take this scout Uber in. Caps is targeting Artis. Bombo really wants this med kill. Bombo trying to go super deep for Log Eye, but now they're gonna get a punish for it. They might have overextended. No, only Caps is the only one who does. Log Eye, Knuckles Uber, Logan finding a trap kill now though, with three kills in the favor of G6, are they gonna wanna, no they're gonna wanna slow down here, just cap mid, and work off that. I wonder if Caps had just decided to ignore Artis and chase the medic, would that Uber have worked out? I don't know, they got, they definitely got really greedy there. Tell you the score, 2-0 on the side of WG. I can't hear them. I feel like game audio is so much louder. What the fuck is it? Someone tell me if the audio is fucked. Hello? Oh my god, I'm so confused. I'm being trolled. <laughs> this game, yeah. Okay, well anyway, we're in mid. I hop got caught. Branson trying to survive here, Valley. His meds are dead, he's looking for a salvage play. We have a back deck going off him. High five. High five! Absolutely crushing bot mode there in that fight. That 
that was... You, you don't like to see that. But uh, he almost got last off that too. Oh my god. He just 182 shot him. And now they're, I think they're going to win this round off that. Like... That's it, 3-0. High five, making the, the round winning play. Despite Logan's attempts. Yeah. 3-0, 18 minutes left, second half. Now, once again, fan favorite Laz on mid because nobody wants to watch anyone else. Laz will spam and then do a small pussy jump probably. Probably not anything crazy. Maybe he'll air shot someone, who knows. He sees both soldiers jumping in, sees his moment. He's actually going back for them and they actually managed to clean up both of them. And he fails to land on the thingy and dies, so. Uh, but, high five, the flank scout, making crazy plays here. Manages to find the medic after, um, Walleye dies at the same time. So, mid goes up in the favor of WG here. They can slow the game now down at this point. They're up three rounds. That was another year's zoning rockets. Good mid. Last copy my mood. Every rumor does that mid, dude. Sit and spam. So, now G6, you know, they're not going to be worried about time yet. I think on this rule set, when you, like, seven, eight, seven minutes is when you get worried. So they have some time to work with, but you also want to, you also have to be kind of worried that you haven't really been able to get any clean looks in a pushing last. We're second, really. Um, you know, who knows? You know, Soapy's ping gone down to 47. Him and Artist share the same ping now. Now there can be no ping coat from Skis. That's that. Both scouts are running deep in the valley this time to make space. And we have a drop. Laz coming in. Drops our. Yeah, both that that worked out very well this time. This time they pressured with both scouts coming in from Valley before sending the bomb, and they managed to find their guy. GG, just end the game. Types Howard. Three kills down. You know, Howard's given up. Full ad here on the side of Wall guy. What is this link witness? What could you possibly be posting? Oh, that is high five with the witness mask. How went you, AGG? You've been playing good, chill. <laughs> you love to see it. <laughs> All right. Well, we got a we got a desperate entry hold here from Caps. Regular season game. Does anybody care? Who knows? We'll see. Logan trying to. Off the Uber with pipes, trying to help the spam out with the pyro. We already have cap presence going off. Howard doesn't have Uber yet. Okay, so dying on the point to try to block it. Bomb mode trying to just roast the whole other team. Howard so close to Uber die, ends up dying at 90 and another wipe. That is 4 0 in the favor of Witness Gaming. 4 0. I'm thinking uh, we'll be done here soon. Now what do we have here? Artist on the mid. Don't care. Back to watching Laz do nothing. Because, oh, he tried to do something. Got punished for it. No pack for him. Gets his pack. Let's see what he comes up with. We have G6 just resorting to playing aggressive. And we lose two on the side of uh, WG. And Laz gets absolutely nothing done and dead. Why do we watch this guy every mid? No one knows. But... Now here we are, back in the G6 driver's seat. Actually able to get a clean look in the second year. Brantam is going to want to take a double scout over to block this though, I think. Nope, offing to go to last. Not even bothering contest, up 4-0, no reason to. So what will we get from Soapy and Bomb mode to try to, you know, get rid of Ubers here? 
Bombin looking like he just wants to run straight into Laza's face. Manages to trade him out. A spoon attempt from Soapy gets nothing. Please get on the onions. Can't get onions is uh what could onions possibly be doing right now? He's in behind, he's on Rakuso, he's killing Logan. Great pick. You know, gives Brandsome some room to work with now that the doors are being stuffed, but we get a shot from Bob Mode. Med drops, round over. GG go next. 4 1. Bomb mode finding, just beefing. His aim does not look clean, even though he got the kill earlier. And they managed to get the round. 4 1. 13 minutes left, a three round deficit. Can G6 clutch up? They've got the one round on the board. Alright, let's watch Soapy since he's the one who has to make it happen. You know, it's time to start just pushing that aggression, just, you know. Please do not watch Laz. Fine, I'm watching Soapy. What do you got for me, Laz? High in the skybox. Fades away. Wants an arrow. He's gonna recommit on the bomb now after getting arrowed. Actually, he's gonna go to house. Caps dies though, but they can't really afford to just give up this mid. So if he's stuck behind, then it's like they're gonna just give him up. And now it's on WG to just go back and hunt Soapy down. Laz versus Soapy. High five just nodding, looking at all guy. Oh, Bombin is wanting the pressure here while Soapy's behind. He's they're trying to look for something. Down th down three rounds, they can't just sit there. Here comes Laz. Laz versus Soapy again, just you know. Oh, but Artist finds Rakuso in front. And Kyle Kyle finds Soapy. Two kills on the side of WG. They're just gonna walk in through lower, uncontested. G6. I think they'll want to take this push. They don't really have the time to just sit on last. Being stuck on last is the worst thing that can happen to you when you're down rounds like this. Ah, uh, they lost too many people to go for it. After Bombwood dies, there's just nothing they can do to go into two. What do you think of the medic class? Very, uh, it can be fun. A little challenging and also very easy. So he's gonna look for the force here. Forces law guy. He's gonna end up dying for it. I think they're chasing back. Nope. Commit forward for the force, and now go back and look for Soapy. Let's hope he have the timing. Nope. He misses the timing and the exit. The wrong door. But we we're gonna have a dry here. Soapy just committed to watching the flank here. Because still trying to pressure so they can get through. I don't know, man. How do you have zero timeouts? I don't know, we're stuck on last. Bombwood's on sniper. He knows he has to make something happen. No gun for the side of G6. He manages to find Brand Slam, that's his entry frag. I think he should be staying on sniper or working more picks. Yeah, he will. Maybe a shutter shot this time. Can he find Artist? He does! Two picks on the side! Sniper really getting a lot of mileage off playing Sniper here for Bob Mode. They've managed to trade out Logan though, and the Uber comes out. Howard's gonna end up forcing here, he drops too many people, this is not good, this should be the closing fight. I don't think Bob Mode can hit the shots necessary to stop the point, and that's GG. Good games everybody. And let's uh, get back to the stat page. Uh, hold on. So we do this desktop. And now. <laughs> Spoilers from Howard. What happened? Did Howard come in the chat? Caps and Howard playing to leave the server. Okay, anyway, <laughs> GG, 
good games from both teams. Good performance from Witness. Uh, G6 looked like, you know, I don't know, regular season games, so they shouldn't really care too much about it. But at the end of the day, a dub is a dub. Brand Slam uh, getting absolutely carried by a bowl of onions, it looks like. After that first half where he was looking really good. Oh, I didn't notice. I wasn't reading chat really. But, um, yeah, GG's. We got, you know, Laz going in, sacking, dying a bunch. Artists with the consistent performance in both halves. Our match MVP has to be Artist. Yeah, this was a land, this was a land slam performance for sure. Uh, no. Then, <sighs> Bombard got a lot, a lot better in that second half. I think, yeah, really great sniper plays. I think uh, when G6 was starting to ramp up the aggression and they were sending both their soldiers in a little more fearlessly, a little more like feed happy, Bombard was getting a lot more looks of opportunities to try to get stuff done. But I think at the end of the day, most of his like key good, like the good stuff that was coming out of him was from Sniper. But um, other than that, you know, we got a drop for both meds in either half. I think they they kind of mirrored each other's performances. They had the exact same amount of deaths both halves. Yeah. Soapy struggling a little in the second half. Logan seemed like, uh, you know, like you could call Logan's first half on. I feel like he was struggling all game a bit, but um, I feel like I don't really know what was going on wrong too hard, but WG it just looked. Dominant and Kyle was coming up with some big plays there. the The 182 shot on the bomb mode was pretty crazy. And then like he pushed them all the way back last, got all that cap time, and WG was able to just win the round off of bomb mode getting absolutely rolled by uh, high five. Mids are typically the middle point of the map. Yeah, mid fights are just in favor. WG WG didn't um they had really. Good patient mids, really. The only mid um, that G6 looked like they won, I thought, was... Uh, I don't even remember. It was like the 4-0 mid, right? It was already 4-0 and then in the fifth round. That was, a, that was a good game. I don't really have anything else to talk about. I'm about to just host somebody. Thoughts, guys? I don't know. Like, What are we doing here? You know, I know, like, could be... Hubby betrayed me, but I think I just host them and call it a day. Fuck you, Zilly. Whoa, 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 chill. What was that? Host a one view on the streamer. Um, uh, Mocha host? Mocha dodged, Mocha dodged movie night, so Mocha doesn't get a host. Alright, anyway. GG's, see you guys later.